So if I get this out on time, this video will have come out on the one year anniversary that I started recording this. That's right, this video took me a year to make. Now, granted, I would go like a month at a time without editing this thing at all, but still, this th thing has been hanging over my head for almost a year. But yeah, I think I'll let past me explain uh, context. I don't freaking know anymore. Take a look at the book titled How to Be a Detective. It's really Ooh. helpful. Oh, thank especially you. Especially if you're new to the mystery solving business. Well, and be sure to check out I my watch a lot of Scooby Doo. Hi, my name is Thomas. Um, I don't really know what this video is going to be. I thought it might be fun to play through and kind of do half let's play, half video essay on a game. That freaking scarred me as a kid. I still have nightmares about the monster or the ghost from this game. I legitimately have nightmares. I had one like a couple months ago. Um, I was like playing a Game Boy game and the face of this thing just showed up all pixelated and like screamed on my screen. I shut the Game Boy all panicked and I look up through my window and uh, a seven foot variation on that ghost is sprinting at my front door. And I just see it through the window. I'm 21 now, so I'm thinking this game isn't going to be so scary. A <gasps> couple things you need to know. I am aware of some of the scares. I was, like, really young when this thing scarred me. I've watched, like, the first, like, half hour, 20 minutes on YouTube recently. I remember who the bad guy is. I actually played, well, my sister played through this game and I saw bits and pieces of it. I didn't see the whole game but I did see the ending. <laughs> uh, so I'm pretty sure I know who did it. I don't know if you can tell but my setup is completely jank. Like I'm on the floor right now and my laptop is crap. This isn't going to be like a Five Nights at Freddy's compilation of Markiplier going <laughs> It's going to be more like <laughs> I'm not the screamer cut type when it comes to this kind of stuff. And that's not to prove how manly I am. I'm, I'm not manly at all. I'm sitting on the floor of my condo about to play a Nancy Drew game. All right, let's see this case file. After a string of tough mysteries, I decided I guess I don't have to, read to take it. a break to do a little sightseeing. I'm taking P.G. Krollmeister up on his offer to send me to his favorite Ryokan, or traditional inn, in Kyoto, Japan. I'll spend the days teaching English and my nights with Bess and George, exploring the sights, fashion, history, and nightlife of downtown Kyoto. From what I hear, the inn I'm staying at is known as one of the scariest places in the city. I'm not sure why people say that. Ghosts. I might have to poke around a little to see what's really going on at the Ryokan Hie. Ghosts. But not real ghosts. We've all seen Scooby Doo. This stupid video is sponsored by Luke. All right, so I already made a mistake. I recorded this whole episode, day one, like this, because a setting in the Nancy Drew settings, I didn't notice a difference while I was recording because I only had one screen to work with. So I had to fix it in editing, uh, which is why the resolution for the game is so low. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, well, I am a senior. So I'm gonna pick junior detective. Is the building on fire? <gasps> Do you believe me now? Well, thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> I'm already awesome. out. It only fell. There's anything you need. Sounds like you have a bit of a draft. Yeah. Right. Robotic cat. What's a Rycon? What is a Ryokan? Dang it. A Ryokan is all. My older sister Yumi will be the one to take over the Ryokan. Well, then where is she? Oh. My grandmother is offering a few classes in traditional arts. She's in room 18 at the end of the hall. I didn't ask. This is really nosy to ask a receptionist, but <laughs> what happened to your mom? I shouldn't bother you with our problems, Nancy. Please. It is very nice outside, a perfect time to relax and enjoy your surroundings. <laughs> just completely just ignores my question. I love it. How's the... whatever it is you're staying at? 
Ryu what is the music it's doing? Great. My heart dropped the in. phone. And the freaking on Ryu ah. gonna be like right in front oh, no. of me. Am I about to run into something? What is going on? Uh, run. Whoa, hang on. Man on the day. I am a man. What do you mean? The baths. The blue banner means the baths are for men. The red banner means women only. I don't know why we don't mention this at the front desk. This is useful information. Anyway, I'm Rentaro. I'm out in the garden if you need anything. I like this guy. Ow, but if I remember correctly, he's the one that did it. <laughs> also, what the frick is going on with the music? It's like, as I'm talking to this comical character, the music is just like So this is actually a consistent issue with the game. In most games, a specific song would play in a specific set of circumstances. Take, for instance, in Outer Wilds, Timber Hearth will play once you enter the Hearthian village. Nancy True, on the other hand, seems to use a collection of songs that it sometimes uses in specific circumstances, like, say, this scene. but it will also use those exact same songs in just random rotation with other songs. So you get moments with some peaceful Japanese music and absolutely horrifying pieces like the Kodo piece. Some of these are just way too suspenseful for basic exploration music. Like, I don't understand why it was chosen to be like this. Like, the one I showed earlier during that mirror scene plays in random rotation with these other songs and causes me to just randomly get <sighs> Like I said before, there are peaceful tracks in the same rotation as horror tracks, which is, that doesn't make any sense. Like one moment you are in a peaceful Japanese ryokan, and the next you're in a spooky Japanese ryokan. Can we decide on one? Personally, I would have kept most of the end's music on the peaceful side and left the detuning till the actual scary parts. That's all I got for this section. It's men only right now. I want to go in. It's men only right now. I want to see some men. It's men only right now. I just realized what I said. I need to go. All right. That was... That freaked me out a little. Not gonna lie. Uh, is this where my room is? I don't have the right key. Okay. Is it this one? I don't have the can't get in. I don't have can't get in. I don't have I don't can't get in. Can't get can't get in there right now. What room am I staying in? I'm becoming that Jim Gaffigan joke about hotels. What room am I staying in? I'm gonna disregard that. Don't touch that. Please stay away from there. It is very easy to get burned. Please stay away from there. It is very easy to get burned. Stay back, please. That's very dangerous. I don't think you understand whatever your name was. I made it through Halo Reach on normal difficulty. Okay, I know what I'm doing. Let me burn myself. I think I'm magic number 24. Boom, it's always 24. Why is it playing this? This is Halo Reach music. Visiting seashore with family. Okay, that's, I'm disappointed in you. Takio. By the way, if you're watching this and you are Japanese, I'm just gonna apologize right now because I don't know how to pronounce literally anything Japanese. I am like, I, I, I can barely read English and that's literally the only language I speak. Welcome to the, yeah, 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 yeah. This is the stuff I skip in real life. I legit thought that was a pack of cigarettes. So, you're American? From New York City? No, a place called River Heights. It's in... Oh, okay. 
Uh, that's Just one of the places. Haunted hotspot guides. So Did we Buzzfeed get a lot of come. ghost hunters here. And that's always a treat because they're totally not obnoxious. So, people think this place is haunted? <laughs> I think I said uh, Buzzfeed Where? Unsolved for that. Some? Here, take this. And this is why I work with machines. They're totally oblivious to awkwardness. I should go. <laughs> I should go. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> He's like, man, that's just too awkward. I'm like, yeah, I should go. Closed door. What is filling up? Ah, uh, if only I knew the glory of what was filling up. What's going on? I should listen in. Yeah, eavesdrop. The strange sounds on the pounding, on the screaming at all hours of the night, waking up my family, scaring the children half to death. If you ask me, this real can need to be closed down immediately. Um, I see a lot at this desk, and one thing never changes. Travel is disorienting. It's so very easy to get upset when you're far from home. That's why we try to make things as comfortable as possible. That was about as good of an excuse as like the people are like, I saw a UFO and people are like, it's a weather balloon, it's fine. Just admit that it's not aliens, it's some kind of government crap, gosh. Also, we didn't land on the moon. Anyways, uh, what's been scaring the guests away? Oh, nothing. They're not scared. It's something else. No, they're clear they're clearly scared. <laughs> wakes you up in the morning quite like a subtle fake act of terrorism. <laughs> Did that really stop me? What's this? Like reach around the corner like that. Sucky Tate. Suki Tate. Dang it. Okay, go now. I'll be teaching then. I should set the alarm for later. You wake up at five? Dude, you need to consider a new job. Aren't you on vacation? Wait, I've decided to take a little break to do some sightseeing. You're waking up at five in the morning? On vacation? Oh, wait, is that? Oh. I was gonna make a joke. part is my bathroom mirror is right over there. What the crap? I thought it'd be okay. This is a child's game. This game is made for 11 year old girls. Can I turn the sink on? I need some comedic levity. It looks like something is missing here. Nancy, you were just attacked by an Onryu. That's not important right now. I actually thought I'd be okay. I knew that exact scene existed. Tara had told me that. Should I report that? Music's bad time. Man, frick that freaking shadow person. All my Hello. homies hate that shadow person. I'm sorry the mirror broke when I was in the bath. Before it broke, I saw an image of... Okay, I thought I was about to take credit. 
for t breaking the mirror because I didn't do anything. You work too hard, Nancy-san. Up too late, off to teach so early. You must rest more. Your judgment suffers if you do not get enough rest. I know what I saw. Nancy-san, please. I have to ask you to let me get back to work. If I didn't already know who did it, I'd assume it's her. But that's a red herring. Also, I hate the fact that the only other residence here is Williams. It's like it knows I'm playing the game. This game is breaking the fourth wall, and the freaking Henri is going to come for me. By the way, if I have anyone in my audience who speaks Japanese or knows Japanese stuff, is it Henri you or Henri O? Because it's spelled like Henri O, but I've heard it pronounced Henri you. I don't know. So, my pronunciation is probably going to flip flop. It is neither, past Thomas. The correct pronunciation is Onyo. I don't know what that R is doing in there, but I'm assuming they stole it from the word Colonel. Where do I find the old lady that I'm looking for? I honestly thought I'd be okay. I didn't think I'd freak out from that. I, I'm 21 years old. I've seen this scene before. I just remembered. We looked it up on YouTube. We, um, we were at a youth camp. We were watching a bunch of scary videos, and I mentioned that scene that I had never seen, but was terrified of. And my friends forced me to watch it. And everything was okay at that moment. I was like, oh, that wasn't that bad. Probably because the scenes we were watching were way less scary. I'm going in circle. Where the crap is this room? Locked. 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 Here's what we need to do, Nancy. Get your phone out again. We're going to set an alarm, and we're going to leave it here because your phone is a bomb. That was a stupid joke. You guys don't laugh at that. If you laugh at that, you have to subs you have to like and subscribe. Yeah. Good one, Thomas. Do you know where I can find the old lady? Thanks for trying. Where the Frick is this old lady? What was the name of that, uh... <gasps> oh, what a shady website. Where is the one lady? Auntie's room and the baths on the left wing while the culture room or take take is in the right. Locked. I need a key to- I need a key to- I need a key to open this door. Do you need a key to open this door? Lock, lock, lock. I need a- I need a key- Ah! I set an alarm. Wait, what were the hours again? 7 to 10.30. It is midnight. Right. I think I'll sleep somewhere more reasonable. Sleep on the ground, dang it, Nancy. You coward. You absolute coward. Coward. How'd it get so late already? I should get to bed. Yeah, you should get to bed, Nancy. <laughs> that's, that's so good. All right, now that I actually know where this is, Nancy san, please sit. It is a pleasure I was hoping I could to just meet run you away. <laughs> Always worry about the guests who stay with us, especially now. What do you mean, especially now? Are you here for a lesson today? No, I'm here to find out what do you mean by especially now. You will be learning katakana. To the outsider, Katakana. You mean the vampire from Witcher looks. 3? You must try until what you see on the paper is not just a word, it is you. Oh gosh. Oops, I should try again. What do you mean you should try again? Look, Nancy, I'm on a trackpad here, right? This isn't gonna be super artful. Just leave it incomplete. Oh no. That's not how it's supposed to look. Ow, I'm gonna get freaking arthritis. No, you think too much. Just practice. Listen here, old lady. I can already feel it in my hand. Trackpad at this angle is a bad idea. That's not how it's supposed to look. Do I have to do it in order? Let me do an experiment. That's okay, not Okay, I botched quite that right. one anyway, so I gotta actually try again. Nope, that doesn't look right. Better start again. Do I have to do it in order? Are you kidding me? How do you make MS Paint stressful? Very well done, yes! Nancy. Yes! This is the best I find a small piece of earth that begs to be made perfect and do whatever it 
asks of you. Someone should tell her that, um, dirt doesn't speak. We have developed a reputation. What do you mean by a reputation? You mean because you have a freaking Onryu on the premises? Okay. I didn't actually expect you to nod at that. Alright, I might as well check out outside. It did the thing. Outside the the uh, Japanese hotel. The uh, Jotel. I need a ticket to ride the train. You need... What? Where do I get a freaking ticket? Good job, me. Rating time! Did it give me this power? No. How do I- how do I give him an F? Did I see a fly? I actually thought I saw something in my bathroom here. Gosh dang it. Seven, I am. Hmm. Kenta, I am. Mm -hmm. Eyes be brown. Eyes really do be brown. How do I freaking give these- fail these kids? I need to fail them. My name is Amy I R Jeff. No. Get a gold star, cause you turned into Yoda. You're gonna get a, a, a frowny face. Suck it, kid. I better have been my train ticket. Yes! I keep thinking I'm seeing something, but it's like the reflection on this microphone. And here we are with a perfect example of the game not holding your hand to a fault. This game does not tell you how the train system works at all. So you're left to your own devices to figure out how the train system works. I spent way too freaking long trying to figure out how the train system worked. The following footage is sped up 20 times speed. Okay, good to know that half the stuff isn't applicable. I have ticket? How do I use a freaking train? Why does it sound like a meme song? I can't identify which one. Like, my first thought is to... Oh, it might be that one I'm thinking of, actually. Kyoto, okay. Frick! In a Barbie world, life of plastic is fantastic. Am I just blind? Oh, the love of- let me there. Do I have to pull out my freaking? Oh. Chocolate rain. Oh, I didn't actually check where I needed. Oh. This is too much freedom. I don't know where this convention is. I am now gonna look this up. That's Sue. I'm gonna have to write some stuff down. <laughs> Holy crap, is that a Spinosaurus cat? Where's your ticket? Where's your ticket? Hey, back away from the door. Can I get arrested? Where's your ticket? I'm just sitting here loitering. Where's your ticket? <laughs> Alright, this is just an endless loop. And what was the other place that was notable? She is. That 
Earth does not actually look that convincing. What was that? Oh no, the screen tour! I better tell Mawako about this tomorrow. That's your top priority right it now? It must have just been my imagination. And with that final act of terrorism, I'm going to end this session. Holy crap. There's... A... Unreal. My next session... Hopefully it stays interesting. Because this is actually pretty effective with the scary. At least that one, that was freaky, jeez. Hi! Uh, uh, welcome back. Um, for you, it's been... Less than a second. For me, it's been a solid week. Um... You know, back when I I played this game a week ago, I was but a child. All right, let's let's get started. Wait a second. I uh I almost started a new game. I'm back to inform why I botched the recording again. This time, I didn't record the game sound because I had to go through a specific set of settings in my computer to record the game sound, and I didn't initiate that. So, uh, I'm finna spark notes this crap at a certain point. Apologies. And I definitely missed some stuff. Uh... Hi, Editor Thomas here, with a worse microphone. Video essay Thomas didn't record the sparks notes that he said he would, so I have to do it. So, that's why I'm doing this. And that's why my microphone sounds worse all of a sudden. Also, I will be voicing characters on occasion. So, uh, expect that. I completely forgot what I did. Sudoku? Uh-oh. Oh no. So, um, slight problem. Um, I can't play Sudoku. <laughs> um, it's not that I don't know how it works, it's just I suck at it. Like, last year, someone handed me a Sudoku puzzle to just work on in the middle of class to turn off half my brain so I could use the rest of it to foot. That doesn't matter. It didn't really work. But that's not important. Uh, what is important is uh, uh, it was an easy book, and I uh, couldn't complete an, a single puzzle. You know, I thought maybe making my, my mustache curled would fix the problem, and I definitely feel more sophisticated. But I don't think my intelligent raised. Point proven by the fact that I called it intelligent. But this guy, this guy at this expo, he didn't predict one thing about me. He didn't predict my curled mustache, no, but that's not important. Well, you know what else he didn't predict? The fact that I can just Google it. All right, let's look this up. <laughs> I'm off to a good start. <laughs> You guys are now getting a glimpse of how slow my computer is. It's not quick. Wait, hold on, back up, is it? I didn't even type that! I didn't type that! What the frick? Okay, That's freaky. Hey, I didn't type that, but that's exactly what I was looking for. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get rid of my lighting source for a bit. All right, so I gotta take a picture, and I'm gonna answer the Snapchat in the middle of recording because Frick you, future me. No, 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 no. Frick you. So now I got that. Uh. All right. So this. Below this nine is a three. Below this five is a three. Here's a three. Here's a three. Here's a three. <laughs> I'm like less than 10 minutes into this recording and I'm already cheating. <laughs> because I cape Sudoku. Count Sudoku more like. That's a good joke, Thomas. It's a good joke. Alright, that's it for ones, twos. Can we get some twos in the chat? Am I really gonna provide commentary for this entire freaking thing? No, of course I'm not. Suck it, future me. It's gonna be really boring. This might be only some, like, uh, uh, you might want to roll some footage over this future me. Um, also, frick you. I don't care how much time this takes out of your day. I only care about me. This isn't what I thought I'd be doing with my Friday. So step one, put the five here. 
and then shove it up your <laughs> six let's get some sixes in the chat oh yeah this is what my viewers sign up for for me to not upload a video for months only to upload me filling out a sudoku puzzle yeah that i'm cheating for <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be a terrible video <laughs> oh no and we just fill it in with nines Woo! yeah gamers this video sucks how do you guys like not even being able to see my face properly is it nice is it nice getting a break from my mustache I don't know why you would want to break. It's beautiful. Look at this curl. <laughs> yeah, I get PTSD from this song now. I don't think you guys understand how stressed I am with this music playing now. That Heacher Thomas. Can you can you do a a, a quick uh, flashback? to when else this music played? Uh, I, I just did. It, I, I, I literally just did like three seconds ago. It's it's right, it's- I hate it. That's the same music. I hate it. <laughs> I'm half tempted just to upload this raw footage of me cheating with Sudoku. Wouldn't that be funny if I did that? Chat, wouldn't that be funny? What do you mean I don't have a chat? I don't even like Sudoku. I'm here to conquer my fears. Because this game scarred me for life. Don't you know? Don't you know? You know, if I didn't need my phone, I'd absolutely just call my... Luke or something. No, wait, hang on. Hello? Hi. You're being recorded. Hi. Cool. This is for a video. I'm here right now. Okay. I can sing you <laughs> I don't want you to sing me a song, Lucas. My dad is saying don't sing from the other room. <laughs> Thanks, Andy. <laughs> I'm seeking you. If he could, he'd be saying, don't talk to me. <laughs> he'd say something like, don't talk to me. Alright, I got it done! How do I, how do I leave? Let me leave! Alright, let's talk on my phone here. Fine, I'll call Bess. Either one works. Hi! I'll let you get back to work. Never mind, Nancy, you don't feel like dropping the news that you completed the puzzle, huh, Nancy? Are you that... Are you that incompetent as a, as a, as, as, as a... <laughs> Why is Luke calling me? What, what are you calling me on Snapchat for? Did you just hang up on me? Yeah, I did. Did you just hang up on me? I hung up on him. <laughs> <laughs> Just gonna dismiss that. <laughs> yes. Hey. What? Nobody hangs up on me. Hang up on me. Okay, thank you. I don't care, man. I just, I just, need, I just need to go. But, but anyways, I was, uh, I, got, I was turning my gain down, and then I was gonna scathe Nancy for not telling George that I completed the puzzle. Interesting. This looks important. I'd better hang on to it. Okay. I just found this! Okay. Sure, let's just take some random property. Halt! It's definitely Sparks Notes time. Let's go. I finally met Miwako's older sister, Yumi, who sounds weirdly Irish, you'll hear that later, who immediately pushed her work onto us. You're going shot. Oh my gosh. 
This is bad for my ADD. I just took a test yesterday, like a big one. I don't want to do any more reading. This request is also three squares wide. Compare its right column with the first request right column. Why would someone order something in this stupid, complicated way? Just tell me what you want, what you really, really want. And I'll tell you what I want, what I really- I finished it and she immediately gave me more of her own work. Don't you say it. Don't you say it. Ah! Oh no, I'm running out of bento boxes. Can you please go grab my backup stock for my- Sure. I'm robbing you. Okay, I still have to do that. All right. Uh, where was she, Kobe? No, 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 she was... Kurume! Kur... 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 Without me giving her my phone number, she immediately sent me this weird text. What the frick? I spill her water? I gotta look for stuff to steal. I don't even want this. Can I take it though? I did the task and when I got back, Yumi gave me this phone charm as an award for uh, doing her work. Then she insulted me. Sounds great. I don't usually have time to keep up with the latest fashion trends. I can sort of tell. I wasn't sure if you were going for the irony thing with your outfit. <laughs> I did more of Yumi's work for her. Big brain got this picture that i could use to hack into our computer then i used this fashion software that allowed me to uh play dress up yep this is a vampire once again attempted to read to the shimuzi Shimu then i just gave up and just took this out of the book i found a way to rob her Woo! would you like a phone charm Either, there are only two possibilities here. I either stole that from someone, from her apartment, and they gave it back to her, or that's the one she gave me. And I gave it back to her. <laughs> then I returned to the Rio Con, talked to Miwako for a bit about nothing in particular, rummaged through other people's stuff. Can I just steal other people's stuff? Stole this credit card, played with this door for way too long. And finally, I attempted to solve this puzzle for approximately one minute. Yes! Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Okay. I am getting tired. I am gonna take a break. Tired of making these massive recording errors, I decided to start live streaming my playthrough. This way, if there were any recording errors, I could catch them early on instead of just recording an entire episode with a massive recording error. It almost worked. I made the mistake of uh, not recording the chat log, so um, I had to try to guess who is saying what based off the context of me reading the chat. So I tried my best. Can we get some uh, hype in the chat, potentially, fellas? Can we get some uh, hype chat and maybe some help with this puzzle that I, I apparently am blind with? Now that I know I actually have, oh, yep, there's Luke. San, that. I have to currently figure out which one of these things match what thing of origami. And that will teach me the ancient art of uh, origami. I don't know how that does, but that's uh, not relevant. No, do it the right way. I, I'm gonna need a little more instructions than this. I don't think Twitch would, I mean, I am a dude, so I'd technically be okay. But at the same time, I don't, I don't think I could really get away with doing that. Okay, now give me your help. Is this prostitution? If I swap these around, 
and then swap these around. One of these combinations has to be right. I'm finna look this up or something. I don't understand. I feel like I've tried every combination. Am I really this dumb? Look, Cameron, do you have a solution? I will happily hear a solution, but I just don't... <laughs> I can't figure this out. Do you have the, Cameron, what's the solution? One sec, okay. You're Googling it, aren't you? Gosh dang it, Cameron. I could have done that, but okay, I'll take it. Wait, let me get my, uh. Is that a... Yeah. I got my curled mustache. It's okay though, I'm wearing it ironically. Oh, you're drawing it in Snapchat? Top mid to bottom mid. Okay, that didn't accomplish anything. Bottom mid to bottom left. Just gonna look. All right, I'm just gonna look it up then. So I was right with like the fish and whatever the frick that is. They are perfect. Oh, hey, look at that. I'm a genius. You have many talents. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I am so talented. I am so talented. I'll talk to you later. Goodbye. Well, I can check that off my list. That was not worth the time. <laughs> She just fell asleep. All right, ghost, I'm ready for you. Come haunt me. I have to find a way to mail something Hi. to... You're not gonna help me with that. I'll let you get Can you mail stuff? T-H. What? Cameron, okay, I'm gonna need more than an acronym. I don't know what you're talking about. I need a dictionary to translate that. Oh, I, lucky for you, Nancy, I have... That's not a dictionary. Wait a second. I just figured something out. Hey. <laughs> oh, there's a fast travel button. Are you kidding me? There was a fast travel button this entire time. I've been wasting so much freaking time. Oh my gosh. I, I hate myself. I should probably address the elephant in, in the phone. It's, it's, that's my, uh, noise for when I get texts in this game. You should hear my alarm, it's it's even better. Okay. Are you guys really just calling everything cringe? I'm not cringe, guys. Guy So, I figured out nothing. Oh, look at that stupid origami piece of crap, origami turd piece of crap. Look, shut up with your stupid cringe comments. How do I do this? This is really important. This will actually progress the story. Is there a mail room? You chat, you're gonna love this. You're gonna love this chat. Oh, check this out. This is so good. Yes! I needed that in my day. I needed that. I needed that. Oh my gosh, you guys are going nuts in the chat, actually. Commit Sudoku. I love it. Maybe if I try calling this number one more time. Because last, last time I called it, he hung up on me. I really need a copy of Savannah's book. Can He's going to say no. Sure. Bookstores are a great start. Or the internet is helpful. But I'm really more of a brick and mortar person, honestly. I suppose you could also go the books on tape route. TV's Ralston Palpers does an excellent job with the text really makes it come alive. No, I meant, could you send me a copy? Oh, nope, but thank you for asking. I'm not sponsored by Audible, Cameron. I wish. Bye. Games. What the crap is this? I'm good. I love that last picture you sent. I love sent. that last picture you sent. I know, isn't that one great? Yeah, I'm glad we talked about that. All right, How goodbye. You Before you ask Luke, I can't eat the bento. Just call me a simp? Uh, no, she's too annoying. I won't simp for her. I'll simp for someone else. I can't eat the bento. I look away for 12 seconds and you're telling me to commit cannibalism? What is going on? This stream is a mess. <gasps> Can you hear it? Get hype. Can we get some hype? Let's 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 have a chat. Nancy, Never mind. Let's I'll not talk chat. To you later. Goodbye. Who do I 
find out how to mail stuff from. Ouch. <laughs> That's why she always tells me not to touch this thing. That's too hot. That's too hot. Ouch. That's too hot. Sorry. I shouldn't be torturing the HC this much. Guys, I, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna cheat. Click on the envelope. What well, I? Oh. Oh. Can I leave this here for my friend to pick up? Yes. Yes. I need help fixing the broken portrait. Take the peg with the most connections and put it all the way in the corner. Oh. Then we've got this one. We do. Yep. We're going to find them, and you're going to flirt up a distraction. That's sort of solution to everything! Yes, you are. <laughs> Suki, mate. Huh? Uh. Oh, wait, I found something. Yeah, this. Oh. Hello. I'm not RPing hard enough. Look, I'm trying, man. Not really, actually, at all. Somehow this is worse with you guys. Oh. All right, it's open. Yeah, <laughs> I figured it out. Yay, I found a trapezoid for a full 10 minutes. Rentero was too cold to talk. That was really nice. <laughs> it had been a while since I'd spent any time around Milwaukee. For any, for once, I caught her in a chatty mood. She's gotten so quiet lately. She's been like a shadow wandering around the house. But last night, she was back to funny goofy girl. I remember from not long ago. Then, you won't believe this. Yumi came in and joined us for, of her own free will. And then my mother came in and we all played a game. No one was forced to join in. There was no bickering. Rent the road. Didn't even have a freak out over the rules midway through it was like a gift from the universe i knew that in that morning we'd be back to bickering complaining the moody silences but it didn't matter one night like that was worth years of misses call savannah gotta go what did she tell me to do i wasn't listening call call what's her name i don't really have the time today bye bye nancy should i try calling again you've reached savannah woodham I'm not available at the moment. All right, I'm going to fix that portrait. So I have to find the one with the most connections. Also got the most connections. So I was actually kind of surprised by the difficulty of some of this game's puzzles. Looks like I'll need a password. Dang it. Some are pretty simple and are just following basic instructions until you get to the end. Others are so incomprehensibly hard that I didn't even try without cheating. Then there are the situations that weren't puzzles, but were just as hard as the puzzles because I had to remember something someone said in passing and get very specific instructions that they gave me through that passing conversation. I don't listen to real conversations, let alone fictional ones. And because I missed these specific details, I wouldn't do the exact specific thing that the game wanted me to do, and I would just be doing nothing for way too long. At least, nothing useful. So none of these can touch. It's the gimmick. Well, I'm already fricking this up. Why does this fix a picture frame? I'm so confused. Making progress. Let's make, oh wait, those are crossing now though. Crap, I didn't mean to do that. Move the bottom right to the bottom left. I feel like that's gonna accomplish the opposite thing of what I want. The ones with the most connections need to be in the center. That's the opposite of what the clue told me. It's like, if this one here didn't exist, I'd be able to solve this. Ah! Oh, well, Halo Reach music's going off now. Come on with this music. This music is way too... Ugh. Was that Jurassic Park? They don't have to be in the corners. It's none of the wires can cross because the tip told me to put the biggest ones in the corners. Stop putting them in the corners. I, it's, that was the hint. All right, fine. I'll call Cam. Okay, you need more than four on the outside, but keep crossing. 
Yeah, but like the problem is, I think if you put them right on top of each other, that counts as crossing. Don't, don't put. Yeah, that would count. But I'm saying, okay, so are you holding me up to the mic? Yeah. <laughs> I want. I, this is. Remember, I'm recording all of this. Oh great. See, I feel like I'm even more tangled up than I was before. Well, yeah, I don't know which. I mean, I can't really tell just looking at which ones go where, but it's definitely not working to just have only four on the outside because they keep crossing over. What was the clues say? It said, put the the one with the most connections in the corner. Singular? Put the ones. Uh. Oh, that's a terrible hint. What the heck? It's in literal corners? I mean, I don't see how else it would be. Uh, see, I, I feel like I sure almost had it, that. and... Well, yeah, well, a lot of times you almost had it. It's, that's the closest you could possibly get. Like, you had one crossing, but that was one, like, really impossible stitch based on the corner. Hold on. What is this thing called? A picture frame? Yeah. I'm looking up the picture to see. Okay. Yeah, right. They have one, two, three, four, five, six on the outside. They have only one in the corner. And it's not, it's definitely not the one with the most connections. Or I guess there could be more in the corner. Just to say they have to. Okay, but there needs to be more than four on the outside. What do you mean by on the outside? I mean like, um, like when you have them in the corner, all of the wires are going inward. The ones that you have four on the outside because everything is inside is contained within their boundaries. Okay. I, I don't know. Yeah, like, kind of like that, but like not crossing, I guess. <laughs> not crossing. Thanks, Cam. Well, okay. I'll try shrinking it in. That might help me get a better perspective on it. I want the wires crossed, by the way. Really? Uh huh. Get up, boy. All right. I think I'm gonna. Yeah. Hang up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go get better to my controller. All right. Oh, well, I probably should have said thanks for the help or something, but that would be like polite. Oh. Okay. Ah. Ah. I got the backing off the portrait. Yeah! Thank you for the help, Cameron. What's this? What? I should hold on to this article. I should translate it first. Or just take it. That works too. This is just a phrase book. I can't translate something as long as this article. Dang it. Can you translate this for me? Sure. I... No. Put this back where you got it. I definitely recognize this voice actress too. <laughs> It's Nolan North. No, Nancy Drew is not voiced by Nolan North. She is voiced by Lonnie Manella. Miss Manella voiced Nancy in all of the Nancy Drew games, except the last one, which, uh, that went over well. Some interesting things about Lonnie is that she actually has a very wide vocal range around four octaves, which is, if I'm not mistaken, around what Freddie Mercury had, although his was at a different range. I think his was lower, but on top of that, Miss Manila has voiced quite a few very interesting characters over the years. The Koopa Kids from Super Smash Brothers, Eve the female Krogan from Mass Effect 3, which I haven't even played that game, I only know about that because I watched Kev do it, uh, kill literally everyone in that game. The Sea Emperor from Subnautica, which, let's be honest, that should be called the Sea Empress because it's a woman, and she plays several characters in the game Skyrim. You know, characters like, uh, Irileth, Janessa, Nocturnal, and the- She's the Night Mother? Wait, what? No. Wait, Nancy Drew is the Night Mother? I need to, uh, go back and play Skyrim. And finally, Bubsy. That is not a joke. I thought you were talking about the, uh, southern chick. She sounded familiar to me. I don't know, Nancy Drew's just so embedded in my brain as a voice actress she is, but... I think this is a pretty good time to stop. I've been streaming for an hour, 45 minutes, so... I think I'm gonna save. Do another recording error. This time, not only did I have the game volume way too low so that I had to use a bunch of compression in order for the people to hear it at home, but on top of that, on this day, my internet was crapping out, and when I recorded this, 
you know, almost a year ago, it kept freezing. And because I just downloaded the live stream and instead of recording it while I was live streaming it, this is the best I got. My apologies. So yeah, when it freezes, that is not an editing choice. That is the stream freezing. All right. Oh, we have some people in the chat, looks like, or in the... I have viewers. <laughs> All right, I don't remember what I was doing. What just happened? What? Dare to play. Why? <laughs> Why did it restart? <laughs> Nancy Shut your mouth, Nancy Drew. I'm trying. Oh, okay, we're good. All right, I gotta go home or to the to the to the. To... I gotta go here. I, I I gotta do. I gotta go. This is gonna be a rough stream. <laughs> Let's go inside the creepy. Uh, real, real, real. Maybe you should stay away from what isn't yours, and maybe he should have the sense to know what is a family matter. I have to get back to work now. Boy, if I didn't know who the killer was, I'd assume it was her. I do know who the killer is. No, uh, Cameron, this isn't a murder case. It's like, I don't even know what happened to the mom. I haven't figured that out yet. But she's dead. And her spirit supposedly is haunting the place. All right, I, I should tell Renthero that his girlfriend's uh, mad at him and that he should stop haunting the place. Hey. Never mind. I'll stop bugging you now. See you later. Imagine someone just walks into your like workplace. Hello. I'm gonna stop bugging you now and just close the door and leaves. I remember what I'm supposed to do now. Oh no, sounds like another unhappy customer. I should listen to what's going on. When we first walked in the door, my wife told me she had a bad feeling about it. <laughs> please, we are not haunted. Oh, please yourself. Poor use of phrasing there. That was the last customer, wasn't it? Yes, Nancy. It's just you. <laughs> so, make yourself comfortable. We are all here Crikey. for you. If something happens to scare you off too. I don't scare easily. I've heard that before. Look, I'm sorry I shouldn't be upsetting you with all of this. Please, you're my only guest left. Let me at least make sure you have a good trip. Maybe you recommend us to your friends. I still want to help. Help? You want to help? Look around you. This place is beyond help. It was spooky and lonely before everything that happened happened, and now... Why do you think Yumi got out of this place as soon as she could? People come because they've heard it's haunted. They come here to be scared and even they can't take it. I'm sorry, Nancy. There's nothing you can do here. Help yourself and find somewhere safer to stay. I still need you to mail something for me, though. Uh, I still have to pretend like something spooky didn't just happen. Four is supposed to be an unlucky number here. I wonder if that's a coincidence. That's fine. Nope. This song plays, and every time I get like PTSD. Find a way to open the sealed envelope without being detected. What sealed envelope? I don't know what that is even referring to. Find a place to put this tile. What tile? Wait. No. Do I have to go to the bathroom? Oh, thank God, I can't even I'll go in. To wait until later. It's the men's room. Actually, I'd like to ask you about... I'd like to ask you about... The tea ceremony is for most yeah. visit for Flens. Did she say Flens? Let us begin. This is called the Furo. Here we have the cha the teapot covered on the Futaoki. This is the Chawan, or tea bowl. The tea scoop is called the Chasaku. This object has its proper place in the ceremony. You must place each item where it belongs. Oh, um, I remember that. You guys remember any of the rest? <laughs> Cause, uh, 
I don't. What is this? Because let us begin. Oh boy. Okay. Each object has its proper place in the ceremony. Right. Uh, I don't remember the rest. We're going through it again, because <laughs> it doesn't. St this is not balanced. This is OP. Each object has its proper place in the ceremony. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is that, and then this is that. Let us begin. Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Look, Cameron, I don't want to hear it, all right? I, 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 I'm aware I'm not very large intelligente. Well done, Nancy. Oh, thank you. I don't swing that way. Where? Go after. That one's not scary. I'm good. What was that? Just a minute. No, go after. What do you mean? It was the wind, the power lines, and shadows. This is nothing to worry about. What? We fixed the portrait. No further questions, Nancy. Why were you so upset when it fell? You would be upset if something you love broke. There was more to it than that. No, that was all. Do you remember when Savannah Woodham visited? I don't recognize the name. She's the one who wrote about the Ryokan. I said, I do not know who she is. You are beyond unhelpful. Last evening, officers responded to an emergency call from 15-year-old Shimizu... Yumi, after she found her mother, Shimizu Kasumi, 42, who runs the Ryokan, lying unconscious in the indoor Ryokan bath. After arriving, emergency crews were unable to revive the apparent drowning victim. Police are currently treating the cr case as a crime, but have yet to press charges. If this is an a accident... That's it. The article ends there. Logan. So, she may not have died. A, so this might actually be... Cameron might be right. Uh, this might be a murder case. I said there was a killer? If I did, what I meant was haunter. Uh, bad guy. The person who did the... Uh, who, who did the thing. Alright, now I can go into the bathroom. No, 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 it's PTSD. Uh, what? Oh! Stop! I've had it! Whoa! You can't keep avoiding me! Leave me alone about this! No, you keep promising me you'll talk to me about moving, and every time I bring it up to you, you freak! Is it not fair? <laughs> There's a, a secret room. I don't want to be here anymore. Yeah, can we get some hype in the chat? Can you tell me a little about Kasumi? She would have been quite fond of you. Why is that? She always loved people who think for themselves. <laughs> and she loved stubbornness. Hey! Uh, can I talk to you about something? Hi. Oh. I know what happened to your mother. I told you to- It was an accident. I think you, all of you, blame yourselves. It wasn't an accident, but since you won't let it drop, you want to know why we all blame ourselves, Nancy? Why? Because we were all here. We were all here that night, and not one of us helped her. 
We all just let her die alone. But you didn't know. Leave me alone, Nancy. I feel like every time I have a conversation with her, I piss her off. Yumi, I don't care. I really don't, all right? I, I just found out how your mother died, and apparently it's not your fault, but I'm not so sure about you. I even know who did this mystery, who made the mystery, and let me tell you, it's probably not you, but I'm still choosing to blame you just because you're getting annoying. Suki, Oyatsu. You fool. <laughs> the cat turned into General Grievous. <laughs> At least I figured out a way to shoehorn him into this get to this to this uh, video. Dang it. Back to this point in the game where I don't know what I'm doing. <gasps> I get more- it's teacher time. I get a grade. Takaru the pig goes quack. <laughs> My cat likes to hunt in the hay. The sheep eats hay. A lamb is a baby horse. Grammatically correct, factually wrong. You get an X. The duck goes quack. True. My cat likes to hunt in the barn. True. The hay eats horse. Gold star. <laughs> The duck goes quack. My cat likes to hunt in the barn. The horse eats hay. A lamb is a baby sheep. Good job. You're not as good as that last girl, but good job. The cat goes quack. My lamb likes to hunt in the... I'm gonna laugh at you. <laughs> You're hilarious. <laughs> duck goes quack. My cat likes to hunt in the barn. The horse eats hay. Sheep is a baby lamb. What does the... Listen, Cameron. So, how are things between you and Rintaro now? Couldn't be better. Liar! Liar! Can I distract her in some way? Can I start a small grease fire? I can't take this if Takai is here. So did Nancy say that out loud? I can't take this if Takai is here. What was that? What's going on? I saw the article about what happened to your mother. That must have been very hard. I said I'm busy. That means leave me alone. Now. I'm busy right now. Okay. All right, now let's see if I can game the system. Are you talking to me now? I'm busy right now. Dang it. All right, I'm gonna try something else. Well, now we're gonna go back, because I still had stuff to talk to her about, I think. Will she still be mad? I, I rode the train back and forth. Have you had time to cool off yet? What's going on? Yes, you did. There are these picture booths, and you get to choose decorations, and you can write out your own messages. I don't get it. There's not much to get. It's well, I didn't accomplish much there. Well, maybe if I break into our apartment now. You shouldn't have given me a key, Mrs. <laughs> All right, I gotta actually grab the key. I came in here to break into her house, but I don't really have a plan now. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing, but is there another like location that I can take the buses with? I'm gonna call myself. Amateur sleuth extraordinaire. Definitely Here's already done this. And I'll track you down later. <laughs> I get it, cause she's a detective. <laughs> Miwako seems a little frustrated lately. Why wouldn't she be? The way guests have been filing out. But maybe she'll finally come to her senses and move to the city with me. Ah, oh, that's his motive. He did it. He did it. He he's the haunter. He uh he's the he's the big haunt man. At the pachinko parlor, they've got this collar I keep meaning to get for Suki. If you could get that, it would be huge. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Where's the pachinko parlor? This is the this isn't what I'm. Uh, cure. It's in cure. Okay. Haha! <laughs> I used my brain. I am not stupid. I am. I'm. 
from me. All right, where is Cure? Cure. 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 Ubi. I gotta get to Ubi. That's that Yure comic looks interesting. I should check it out. Yure? Rantaro seemed like he really wanted that collar. Uh oh. I think I have to go gambling. <laughs> Ugh, creepy. I don't think I need to keep this one. I think we should keep it. Dang it. All right, chat, while I, uh, gamble my life savings away, uh, how's life? You say you woke up? I, you woke up at a bad time, Cameron. Well, on the bright side, I only have one more ball. This game's rigged. Woke up, Ohio still exists, day ruined. <laughs> Which one's the... I think I'm gonna grind this... I don't know what else to do, though. I was gonna grind this off camera, but... All right, we just gotta spam this as fast as we can. Don't pay attention to my prizes, just go. I'm gonna use this opportunity to talk about something, the real stuff, you know? You know, um... Scientists should be held accountable for what they just preach out into the world. They're just random guesses being projected as fact. The most offensive one I can think of is the fact that some genius discovered the Overraptor and decided to name it the Overraptor, which literally translates to egg thief. The reason he called it that is because they found it with eggs and they looked at that and they said, well, that can't be his eggs. You know, he clearly stole these eggs. Those were his eggs. That, that was the Overraptor's eggs. And now it's been giving a false name because they thought, oh, that can't be the Overraptor's eggs, you know? But lo and behold, the Overraptor didn't do anything malicious. It was just an Overraptor. And it's and now it's been given the name Overraptor. This is just we need to hold scientists accountable. We need to tell them, "Hey, how did you come to this conclusion of calling this thing the Overraptor?" I agree, Cameron. It is based. Do you think whoever made this part of the game was proud? Another thing I think we need to talk about is the fact that whales are going extinct, but no one is doing anything about it. You know, we need whales in life. We need whales. How many of those do I have? 1,000. Okay, let's see how much I need. I need 3,439. 3,439. All right. Uh... Yeah, we're not doing enough to save the whales. I'm not. You know what? Whales are the only animal that are both derpy and majestic. So we need to protect them. We need to stop the the whalers, the drunken whalers, all right? I have an entire song about slitting drunken whalers' throats. Even one whale is too much? Are you saying, like, the loss of one whale is too much? Because I agree. I agree. The loss of one whale is too much for me to handle. All right, we need to protect whales. You know, whales, they're just, they're swimming all the time, yet they're still fat, you know? Are you saying whales existing are too much? Listen here, Cameron, I will unmod you. You take that back right now. I, I, I'm literally not moving on until you take that back. I better see you taking that back. You wouldn't. You would not. All right, I will let you keep your mod for the whale. But if I see you hurt that whale, you're getting unmodded. Do I make myself clear? That whale doesn't get touched. Oh, there goes the last of my balls. Y'all listen to uh, One Republic's new stuff? It's uh, not as good. It really isn't. It's it's not One Republic. It's it's hip hop basic pop. It's that standard uh, overdoing it on the hi hat crap. All synthetic drums, and I'm I'm a little disappointed. It doesn't feel like the genreless stuff that they they do all the time. It's it's not One Republic. It's you know, because even with Oh My My, they were still going for that standard pop sound. But at the same time, it was still them. It was still their music. You could, it still had their signature, genreless, trying new things style on it. Like, Born is a super unique song. Yeah, Warner Pogue's still kicking. They're still making music, um, technically. They're, you know, I, I'm not looking forward to this new album. They have that song, Wildlife, which is, I like that one. I like that one. That one's, that one's more unique. That one's special. It's disappointing. I mean, Bastille, I'm not a super big fan of their new song, but I feel like 
it might grow on me, but it's it's weird. It, it, like, at least I'm not thinking, wow, this is a pop sellout kind of situation, like with Wonder Public. No, it's just weird. It's just weird music. And I'm gonna have to go again, I'm realizing. I mean, don't even get me started on Imagine Dragons. They just make random production choices just for the sake of making those random production choices. But like, oh, it's popular to have higher pitched voices in your music. We should throw this thunder. It's annoying. I feel like that song would have been a lot better if they just didn't do that one thing and they filled it with something, some other kind of higher end thing to balance out all the low end stuff they were doing in the song, you know? That's what I'm going to audio engineering school is to maybe make these kind of judgments with songs before they even get out there. And maybe I can help fix modern music. <laughs> that was the stupidest thing I've ever said. Three, four, 96. I think I have enough. Yuri Illy gets on my nerves. What is this? What are what are we doing, Kit? Ghost hunting. Gulp. Can't we just go fox hunting instead? How many times do I have to explain why that's not funny? He's not wrong. It's not funny. Well, here we are. Go ahead and open the door, Kit. I'll let you get the door since you're the one with opposable thumbs. <laughs> I fake coughed, and it actually triggered real coughing. <coughs> Ow. Recording a side of a haunting might actually be a really good idea. I should look into that. Well, I'm not going to read it anymore. Nancy Drew figured out why she needed to do that. I got that collar for Suki. Oh, Nancy-san, you are the best guest we've ever had. I'm going to go give this to her now. Please, excuse me. <laughs> Immediately rob him. <laughs> You're welcome. But I have no clue what to do in a clothing store. I sort of just... Okay. I don't know if I'm dyslexic or something, but I saw the word looking above when he says no clue. It was like right above it. And in my brain, I read that as, I have no effing clue. <laughs> it's just like, wait, wait, I thought this game's made for kids. She said she was looking for the perfect outfit. I think that'd be a great gift, but I have no clue what to do in a clothing store. I know of a program that might be just the thing. Y you like, uh, you like vampires? Hey, best, you like, uh, you like snakes? This looks stupid. <laughs> wait, I could... Oh. It's perfect. It's beautiful. Ha! Did you get the avatar I sent you, Bess? Yeah. Good talk. What the crap? Still have to do that. I have to go back. Check. This game's making me lose my mind. What did I do? <gasps> Someone's been in here. It looks like whoever left those footprints walked right through the wall. Okay. Not gonna lie, it was mostly Nancy screeching that scared me. They no clipped. <laughs> that wasn't red before. Oh, so apparently if you write that you're someone's name in red, 
in Japanese, in there's a superstition in Japan that that something bad will happen to the person. At least my chocolate bars weren't stolen. Oh Yatsu! Can you go General Grievous for me? <laughs> Thank you. Does this not open up? Well, guys, um, I think that's a decent place to leave it off. Nope. No, 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 not this music. No, 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 no. I don't really have an outro. I'm tired. My brain hurts. My leg hurts because I'm sitting on the ground. This music's stressing me out, too. Uh...